thanks for tuning in. This is Off the Bottom. going to do another video review. And today we're going to be taking a look at, just in time for the holiday season, the Ghostbusters 2 4-pack, kind of a holiday version, available only at Toys R Us. These are the Ghostbusters in their Ghostbusters 2 dark gray jumpsuits. Now there are two variations of this. You have this version right here, which has just the regular guys and Slimer here in the center. And you also have this set. Now I'm actually not going to open this one. I'm going to leave this one. I have I have both of these sets. This variation comes with Slimer off to the side, as you can see over here, and they're wearing all of their hats that they wore for a brief scene in the Ghostbusters 2 movie. Now these jumpsuits were only seen during the Christmas holiday season that coincided with the Ghostbusters 2 movie. They were running through the streets and they were wearing these outfits. There wasn't anything else special about these, but these are nice variations that really give a nice nod to the Ghostbusters 2 movie itself. But we're not going to review this set, we're going to review the original set that I just showed you. Now why am I going to review this one? Because this is the one that I'm actually going to open. The other one with the hats on, now see these ones do come with the hats, but I don't know if you can see them, but they're actually down here, they're not wearing them in this version. The version with the hats I'm going to keep as my display pieces for Christmas time. It's, it's a Christmas decoration now for me, because they're wearing little Santa hats. And these guys I'm going to swap out every now and then with the original release versions. But as I said, available only at Toys R Us. These are for adult collectors. You flip it around here on the back. And it says, for more Ghostbusters and action figures, go to MaddieCollector.com. Personal file, you have a nice picture here that showed up at the end of Ghostbusters 2 that replaced the picture of Lord Vigo, which is a really nice picture. I really like the way that looks. As Peter said, he, he thinks it's done by one of the fettuccinis. <laughs> uh, you read the back here, and the name is Ray Stance, Peter Rankman. Egon Spangler and Winston Zedmore. Ray Stance is an expert on paranormal history, owns his own occult bookstore, designs Ghostbusters equipment with Egon, and his quote is, we think the spirit of a 17th century Moldavian tyrant is alive and well in a painting at the Manhattan Museum of Art. <laughs> Peter Frankman hosts a psychic-themed talk show, thinks hairless cats are weird, and needs to feel loved and desired. And his quote is, We're the best, we're the beautiful, we're the only Ghostbusters. Egon Spangler is the strategic right brain of the outfit, performs advanced theoretical research, invented the Geiger meter, and says, Ray, we'd like to shoot the monster, could you move please? It's when these, these are all from the Ghostbusters 2 movie, all these quotes. Winston Zedmore was an enthusiastic children's party entertainer, <laughs> hates gelatin desserts, loves New York, and in the movie he said, it's very potent stuff. We made a toaster dance with it. And then obviously you got uh, weird looking desktop stuff, which I wonder what that says. That says, I'm trying to read the fortune cookie on here. Any doubt you may have will disappear early this month. That's what that says. <laughs> Got the nice Ghostbuster 2 logo right there. I just really love this box set. I'm tempted to not even open this one either because you got Slimer here in the middle. But and you all want to see me open the Ghostbusters 4-pack. So let's get it open and see what we have. Okay, so here we have the Ghostbusters 2 variants of the Ghostbuster figures opened up and out of their packaging. And really, there's not much of a difference. If you guys have seen my previous Ghostbuster reviews, there's not much of a difference with this. This is a $60 set that comes with four Ghostbusters, Slimer, and some cloth hats. Um, if you were to buy them through MaddieCollector.com, they're $20 a piece, so you do get a little bit of a deal, but you also lack in, in some of the accessories. Now, the, the re-release of Egon came with uh, a stack of books and a PKE meter. Winston came with a trap. Peter came with another version, Slimer, I think it was, and Ray, uh, the little Ghostbuster on the logo stand thing. So you're not really getting too much of a fantastic deal. But if you're a completist like I am, and if you love Ghostbusters as much as I do, this was just a natural thing that I had to buy. Now there are a couple, some of the biggest differences are the fact that the faces look much more lifelike. They're a whole lot better looking. If you can kind of see, there's a lot more color in Egon's face as opposed to the previous versions. Oh, focus on Egon. Um, so it's a lot nicer. The only one that really doesn't show much of a difference would be Winston, and that's, you know, because he's, he's, he's black, so there's not really much you can do with that. And that probably sounds bad, but I mean no offense with it. Uh, they do have the Ghostbuster 2 logo patched on the side of their arm. They all have their names on there. They have different color uh, radios. They're yellow on this. But everything else is identical. Um, 
the backpacks are all permanently attached, so that's not something that they fix, so it kind of gives less hope that we'll ever get an actual Ecto vehicle. Uh, one thing that kind of sucks is you can see the handle here is permanently bent. It's very soft rubber, so it's bent like this because of how it was displayed in the packaging. That, that's supposed to be able to remove, but that doesn't seem to actually come out. All the other versions they removed, but it does open up and you can have an opening trap. So now I basically have, I think, three traps because the Walter Peck one, I think, when it, when it came with the uh, containment unit, came with the trap too. So, well, maybe this is the third trap. The Peter figure has the new face from the figure with the proton stream. Uh, he's got a little smudge there on his, on his cheek. Try to get rid of that. Uh, there we go. Um, a much nicer face. I really like the way that looks. That looks a whole lot more like Bill Murray to me. A lot more color in it. The hair is nicer looking. I even like the fact that he's got like little wings here flaring out from the side. Very nice figure. I really like the way that the new face looks. And obviously he's got the, the pants on the outside, the untucked pants. And Ray, now, now the Ray one actually looks a little worse, in my opinion, uh, with the more color in his face. But um, overall, not too terribly bad on that. Slimer has got the open mouth version. There was an open mouth one, and there was one where he sticks his tongue out, and I really don't like that. But uh, he's got articulated arms at the elbow, the wrist, and he uh, art is articulated at the shoulder. I just got to find the right joint. There it is. So you can kind of have him posed more down like so and then the other aspect is they come with cloth hats santa hats that just slip over on their heads and here they are with their santa hats on <laughs> and, and honestly they're, they're a little bit of a pain in the butt to actually get onto them for some reason i don't know why maybe it's just me but a fantastic looking set like i said it's 60 dollars at toys r us right now so if you want to get this and if you want to get all four ghostbusters in one shot that's going to be your best bet. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, this has been Optobotomous. I'll talk to you later.